Our protocol is designed to probe the biophysical mechanisms governing the transport of cargo by teams of identical or oppositely directed cytoskeletal motor proteins. By using DNA origami for molecular construction, this method controls for the type, number, and location of motors on precisely defined cargo shapes. While this protocol focuses on the microtubule-based motors dynein and kinesin, it is adaptable to the actin-based motor myosin, as well as to other protein systems that function cooperatively. One challenging aspect of this protocol is to maintain the integrity and activity of the motor proteins throughout the purification process, as they are sensitive to heat and mechanical force. To induce motor protein growth and expression via galactose promoter, use a sterile inoculation wand to streak the frozen yeast strain of interest on a yeast peptone dextrose culture plate for a 3-4 to four day incubation at 30 degrees Celsius. On day 4 of culture, when the optical density at 600 nanometers is between 1.5 and 2, collect the yeast cells by centrifugation and resuspend the pellet in water to wash them and consolidate the cells in a single bottle. Spin the cells again for collection and resuspend the pellet in about 2 milliliters of double distilled water. Then use a 10 milliliter pipette to slowly dispense the cell slurry into liquid nitrogen, one drop at a time, to produce frozen yeast cell pellets. For motor protein purification, use a blade type coffee grinder pre chilled with liquid nitrogen to grind the frozen yeast pellets into a fine powder and transfer the yeast powder into a pre chilled 100 milliliter glass beaker on ice. Add a small volume of freshly prepared 4X lysis buffer with supplements to the powder.